In this series, we showcase the faces behind some of the popular street names in Zimbabwe. In the capital city of Zimbabwe, Harare, and many other places, you will find Rekai Tangwena Road. It was named after Chief Rekai Tangwena. If you love the work that I do on this channel, please consider partnering with me on Patreon. From as little as $3, you can help me improve the quality of the videos that I produce on this channel. On that note, help me thank my biggest Patreons, Tom Ward, Takwiri Larino Mota, and April. Thank you so much for the continued support. When it comes to Zimbabwe's War of Independence, Rekai Tangwena's name is often mentioned. The chief of the Tangwena people of Nyanga is a symbol of resistance to Zimbabweans and Africans alike. Following Rhodesia's Land Apportionment Act, most Africans were driven out from their ancestral lands to less productive areas, known as the reserves. Chief Tangwena and his people, on the other hand, refused to leave their land in the Gayaresi area of Nyanga. He argued that land was God-given and sanctified by ancestral occupation and heritage. Rekai Tangwena's rift with the Rhodesian authorities started as soon as he was made chief. He went to the district office to inform the native commissioner that he was now the chief of the Tangwena people, but he was informed that it was not possible since the Tangwena people were, according to Smith's government, squatters. On a farm owned by William Hanmar. On several occasions, Tangwena refused to be evicted from his ancestral lands, even in light of an eviction order from the Ministry of Home Affairs. Despite the Rhodesian government losing in court to Chief Tangwena and his people, the authorities later resorted to using force to get him out of his land. It was on September 18, 1969, that the Tangwena people were evicted from the land in a violent manner in which some of the Tangwena people were beaten up by the Rhodesian police. Rekai Tangwena also led demonstrations against the colonial authorities at Nyanga police station, despite the brutality that had earlier been exhibited by the police when they evicted his people from their land. However, Tangwena is most celebrated for his role in helping the liberation heroes such as the late Robert Mugabe and Edgar Tekere to cross into Mozambique. He also assisted many boys and girls to join the liberation struggle in Mozambique. Eventually, Rekai Tangwena also joined the trek into Mozambique to join the liberation struggle as well. Leading up to independence, Rekai Tangwena became a senator in March 1980, despite his age. Chief Tangwena died on June 10 and was buried on June 16, 1984, at the age of 74. He is the only local chief to be buried at the National Heroes Acre. That is the face behind Rekai Tangwena Road.